Hello and welcome back to Footy Adventures. It's Sam here taking you through a different variety of games and stadiums from around the world. Today I am in Athens and I'm making my way to the Olympiakos Stadium, the Karaiskakis Stadium. I'm sorry if I've not pronounced that right. I'll try and get it right when I'm there. If you are planning a trip in the near future, there is a link in the description of all my videos where you can get a free Airbnb credit. It won't cost you anything. It'll actually save you money on your trip. Uh, so to help me out and if you enjoy these videos on the channel, uh, it'd be massively appreciated if you could just take a look. But just watching the video and giving me a like is way more than what I expect. So thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, please subscribe to the channel. If you've been here before, then as ever, it is great to see you again. But yeah, today I'm running down to the stadium. So let me take you down there with me. So I've made it to the largest football only stadium in Greece. There are larger stadiums, but they're like multi-purpose. The Karaskakis Stadium, which is home to Olympiakos, pretty much the biggest and most well-known team here in Greece. There's a little cafe there behind me, as well as like a gym, a taekwondo or boxing club. Here's the gym here, closed at the moment, the boxing gym. Um, but there's like a real gym here. There's like a lot of stuff to do around the stadium area, the complex. There's the club shop, which is just over there, which I'm gonna go into in a minute. I'm looking for the museum. There's apparently a museum here that I've heard about online that you can go into. I've heard that it's free entry, but let's go and take a look. The stadium can hold over 32,000 people and was built in 1895. It has obviously been renovated many, many times since to what it is today, a nice modern stadium, but it just goes to show the history of the club and of the stadium itself. Not only Olympiakos games, but it also has held Greek national team games as well. So here is the club shop, the Red Store, Olympiakos Red Store, where you can get all your merchandise, your shirts, your shirts and all that kind of good stuff that you'd find in a football club shop at a stadium. But let me go and try and find the museum. I still haven't got around to it. Let's go take a look. So as you can see, I'm inside the red store, the club shop. Um, just spoke to one of the people in the shop as I couldn't find the museum. It's only open on match days, which isn't today. So fun times, I'm gonna miss out on the museum, which is a shame. But uh, yeah, inside the club shop now, where you can find all your Olympiakos merch. So while I am here, I will tell you about Olympiakos as I can't go into the museum and find out all there is to know in there. The reason that they are the most supported team in Greece is probably due to the fact that they have won the Greek title 44 times and the Greek Cup 27 times. That is probably the most successful team that I've visited so far on Footy Adventures. Pretty good numbers there from the club. Um, yeah, just showing why they're the best and the biggest team in Greece, basically. The stadium is in an area called Piraeus, which is down near kind of where you'd get the ferries out of Greece, near the coast, uh, out of Athens rather. And yeah, it's a really nice part of Athens down there by the water. And that's where you'd come to see the games of Olympiakos. It's a little bit outside of the city of Athens, but it's close enough to make it kind of a comfortable journey. So my next game is gonna be a big one. The I've actually got tickets for a game with some absolute European giants. Completely different country to what I'm in now. They are one of the biggest teams in the world and I cannot wait to go and see them. By the time this video is uploaded, I should be on my way to that country, kind of. Um, but yeah, by the weekend, I will be at that game. So make sure you follow my Instagram. I'll do a story from the game. So you'll see that like a day before about a day before the actual vlog comes out on YouTube, which will be the day after the game. So give me a follow on Instagram, footy.adventures. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more from stadiums and from games from around the world. Give this video a like. Sorry I couldn't take you inside the museum. 
and I will see you in the next one. Thanks very much for watching.